Hello and welcome. In this math tutorial, our task is to find the value of root 2 minus 1 to the power x minus root 2 plus 1 to the power x. Given that root 2 minus 1 to the power x plus root 2 plus 1 to the power x is equal to 2 root 5. Now we were told that the exponent x is a negative real number. To solve this problem, let us call the value that we are looking for d. The next thing we are going to do is that we are going to add these two equations. Notice that when we add the two equations, this is going to be eliminated because here we have positive and here we have negative. And we are going to have two of these. So we have that two times root two minus 1 to the power x is equal to 2 root 5 plus d. The next thing we are going to do is to subtract this second equation from the first equation. So now we have subtraction. Notice that when we do this, this is going to be eliminated and we are going to have plus root 2 plus 1 to the power x minus minus root 2 plus 1 to the power x and of course that is equal to 2 times root 2 plus 1 to the power x and this is going to be equal to 2 root 5 minus d so here we have 2 root 5 minus d the next thing we are going to do is that we are going to multiply these two equations. When we do that, 2 times 2 is equal to 4. Now, you can see that we have root 2 minus 1 to the power x multiplied by root 2 plus 1 to the power x. They both have the same exponents. So we can write it as root 2 minus 1 multiplied by root 2 plus 1 both to the power x and of course on the right hand side notice that we have 2 root 5 plus d and 2 root 5 minus d and remember that when we have a plus b multiplied by a minus b this is simply equal to a squared minus b squared which is the difference of two squares so the product of these two numbers is going to be 2 root 5 squared minus d squared according to this formula so we have 2 root 5 squared minus d squared now also when you look at this you will see root 2 minus 1 multiplied by root 2 plus 1 which is exactly the same thing so we have 4 multiplied by this is also the difference of two squares so here we have root 2 squared which is equal to 2 minus 1 squared which is equal to 1 to the power x and this is equal to 2 root 5 squared 2 squared is 4 multiplied by root 5 squared is 5. This is equal to 20. So here we have 20 minus d squared. Of course, 2 minus 1 is equal to 1. And 1 raised to any power is equal to 1. So on the left hand side, we have 4. And this is equal to 20 minus d squared. Rearranging this equation, we have that d squared is equal to 20 minus 4 which is equal to 16 and taking square root of both sides of the equation we have that d is equal to plus or minus square root of 16 which is equal to plus or minus 4. Now that we have found d to be equal to plus or minus 4 let us remember that x the exponent is a negative real number. So for instance, if x is equal to minus u, then this is going to be root 2 
minus 1 to the power minus u minus root 2 plus 1 to the power minus u. And of course, you know that when we have negative exponents, this can be written as 1 over root 2 minus 1 to the power u minus 1 over root 2 plus 1 to the power u. Now, you know that root 2 minus 1 is less than root 2 plus 1. And you also know that the reciprocal of a smaller number is always greater than the reciprocal of a larger number. So this difference is going to be positive. So we have that when root 2 minus 1 to the power x plus root 2 plus 1 to the power x is equal to 2 root 5 and x is a negative real number, then root 2 minus 1 to the power x minus root 2 plus 1 to the power x is going to be equal to plus 4. And with that, we come to the end of today's tutorial. I hope you learned something new. If you enjoy such content, please subscribe to the channel. Leave us a like to support the channel. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.